Detectives on the hunt tonight for a graffiti vandal. Tonight, the list of buildings tagged is growing. Good evening, everyone. I'm Josh Benson. I'm Jennifer Lee. Thank you for joining us tonight. He's more a problem than Picasso, and Polk deputies really want to snag this graffiti vandal before he strikes again. News Channel 8's Melissa Marino joins us now live at one of his targets, a building behind the historic Polk Theater. And Melissa, I guess he's hit more than a half dozen buildings so far. Yeah, that's right. And take a look. It's tough to tell exactly what it says or what it what it means, but he's obviously costing these local businesses money. This graffiti vandal is using other people's property as his canvas, but these business owners aren't calling these works of art. I had to have, you know, somebody go down and buy some paint and had them had to cover it up and take their time off of work to go out, you know, from hauling feed out to do that. Beverly Lay, owner of Lay's Western Wear and Feed in South Lakeland, is one of seven businesses targeted. Security cameras caught the graffiti vandal tagging or spray painting outside of Aloha Tanning in Lakeland. Other locations include the historic Polk Theater in downtown Lakeland and a vacant building directly behind it. It's very disturbing to us that any of the buildings would have graffiti, especially the historic district. And I grew up as a kid going there. Elvis went there, uh, so it's a great historic building, and we definitely do not want anybody else uh, disturbing that. But this so-called artist is clearly unfazed by the mess he's leaving behind for these business owners to clean up. It's pretty frustrating because it's um, it's the lack of our kids being respectful. Well, here at the Polk Theater, you can see they tried to wash off the graffiti off their building, but it, it hasn't come off. And they told me that they're trying to figure out what they're going to do because the process that they could do is expensive and sometimes does more harm to the building than it's worth. Jen? So frustrating. Melissa Marino, live for us in Lakeland tonight. Thank you.